Welcome all to the Sun TDM. This is another video for Foundry VTT. Uh, it's another module com um, review video. This one I'm looking at a module called Compendium Browser. Uh, you'll see at the bottom of the screen here. I'll show you that in a minute. What this does, it allows you to quickly search through your compendium without trying to figure out where anything is. Um, so for me, I think that's pretty useful. So I'll show you it. There's no settings to it. Once it's installed, you get it here. So you go to your compendium tab at the bottom, get this little button, and you get this little thing here. And you can see that you got spell, feature, item, NPC, and settings. So settings will go through them. So you can see what it's loading. So if you have multiple different uh, compendiums, you can choose what one it goes through, uh, what one it searches for you. Uh, you can allow players to access it as well. Um, but on here, so you see he's got these spells, but if I want to look for, let's say, I want to find Moonbeam quickly, or spells with Moon in them. You can type in Moon, and it loads, and it loads the various different Moonbeams that I've had when I've been playing around. So you can see that there. Uh, you can sort by name and level. So if you wanted to just have a low, so it, it shows a maximum 500. And then from here, sorts it by um, by the spell level. You can choose what source, choose what school. So if I want just abjuration spells, it will now sort through all those and filter out only abjuration spells, which is, again, really quite cool. Uh, you can choose by class, so if I want abjuration spells for an artificer, it will show me there is a total of 47 spells the artificer can take. These are, however, different variants. And the other thing is, if you hover over them, it will show you which compendium it's being pulled from. So, because I've got multiple ones, um, you'll have some from like the SRD, but there's also ones because I've got like MIDI, so this one's here, you can see here. This is with the MIDI SRD. You can also filter out um, spells that are ritual. So this will now show the there two ritual spells. Concentration. All the options there. Those are quite cool. So these are all re really quite cool just to kind of filter. If you quickly are looking for a set of spells to give someone when you're building an NPC, your player said, I've taken this spell. Really useful if you use the d d on Beyond Importer because you... Obviously, that brings in all the spells. So you literally have access to every spell. It, it can bring it all into Foundry. On here, you can quickly search and it will go through and you can do like that. Same thing goes with feats. So you've got what class um, activation. So if you have a feat that is, you're looking for a bonus action feat. It will obviously search through here and it will find all, pull out all those ones that are tagged as bonus actions. Or if you're looking for ones that have different damage types. Or if it expends a resource. Uh, item browser, similar thing. Uh, so damage type activation. What weapons? So if you want, I only want to find all the martial ranged weapons. It will search for import those out for you. It's pretty much as you might expect. Or if you've got magic items. We've um, got NPCs, same things, uh, a bit more options here, so you can choose how these all, all look. Um, so if you're looking for creatures that have like acid immunity, uh, it'll pull those out. I'm not going to go through all those, it, you can see how it works. The reason why I like this is because, as you know, you are best kept keeping all your, anything you're not using for a few sessions in compendiums. Rather than having a boatload of stuff just kind of sat there waiting, uh, you can have your compendiums there ready. Um, you have it all in compendiums stored away. Uh, so when you like build something, pop it in compendiums, and then you can search on here. So it makes searching really quick, really simple, really easy. I absolutely love it. Uh, if I used to start using it properly, uh, I've had it for ages, and then I realized it was there. And, oh. and I would recommend for people, especially if you keep your things in compendiums. So yeah, uh, quick, simple video. It's a very simple module. I hope you liked the video. I hope you found it useful. If you did, please um, like the video. Drop me a comment if you have anything to say. Um, follow the channel if you're interested in what I've been doing. I also have my socials, uh, Discord and uh, Twitter and stuff like that in the links in my description below. 
please feel free to come like drop by and say hi and i'll catch you all next video